hello everyone so the thing is i want to digitalize the components of other softwares into the katia so uh, for example i just want to use solidworks component inside the katia v5 so that i can use them for uh, assembly purpose or uh, katia modification purpose so what to do so now my main requirement is i want to use some of the parts of SOLIDWORKS so that I can use them to create the Katya assembly so let me just try I'll just try to browse I'll try to browse the components of Katya here just a minute okay here you can see these are the SOLIDWORKS component so let me just try with this so this is crane hook I just want to browse it open so it shows invalid data means whatever the components of there of all the softwares you won't means it won't be directly patched here because their file formats will be different file ex extensions will be different now so for this what I need to do so let me just uh, define the file location okay so I'll browse this SOLIDWORKS first this is the component crane hook first you need to save this as step file or IGS file so you can check here there is no format like you can directly convert SOLIDWORKS component to Creo or ProE part template otherwise there is no other uh, template for converting into Katia part files and all so I'll directly convert this into IGS format I'll save it on desktop I'll do that so I'll rename it as crane hook 111 so this is my step file now this is done I'll directly go to Katya here and here I'll try to browse that open let me just pause it yeah this is my file so I just file crane hook 111 so I'll open it here once you do that that component will be open here now you cannot directly take this component into assembly and uh, make the assemblies because Katya v5 won't uh, give the proper access and uh, surfaces to it because you can see all the surfaces are mismatching I need to do something means I need to convert these surfaces to the Katya file so that I can use this as a part file so for that I need to browse this component into the shape that is generative shape design so these all surfaces are uh, like this has some errors so I need to patch them first I'll use heal first I'll select heal and I'll select all the surfaces like this you can check all the surfaces got selected then I'll use ok so now I just heal everything this is the healed files now once you heal it I'll go with join so I'm going to join this all the healed surfaces and I'll click on ok now all the surfaces are joined together so once your surfaces are joined I can again switch to part, part design here by using these options thick and close you can create the solid that is Katya solid part I'll use this closed surface it shows there is no object so now by using this option I'll directly select the joint surface I'll click on ok now once I hide this surface as you can able to see the Katya part ok now you can directly utilize this as part file so you can save it save as or save directly as a part so I already saved it and now you can use it so like this you can convert the uh, other uh, file formats into Katya files by just uh, joining and healing them and then uh, using close and convert to 
save it as cut your files so thank you for watching please do like and subscribe on channel bye everyone